CJ today I want to come to you with my favorite hair care products. They are leave-in and moisturizing milks and moisturizer or moisturizer creams. If you are interested in seeing this video, then keep on watching. So you guys know I did a poll if you wanted to see me do 12 days of Christmas. So I said I was going to switch it up this year. I was going to do 12 days of Christmas, but I was going to do some videos and some vlogging. So this time I'm going to do a video for the 12 day of Christmas segment. So here we are and I'm going to start rambling and we're going to jump right into it. Right, so we're going to start off with leave-ins. Now I love leave-ins. To me, leave-ins adds extra moisture to your hair, especially if you have natural hair, okay? So, natural curly hair tends to be a little bit drier than your regular, like, perm hair, you know? So, when I had a perm or relaxer, my hair, it wasn't nearly as dry at all. Actually, I thought my hair was oily. So, but now, since I'm natural, I've been natural over maybe six or seven years now, I noticed that my hair tends to be a little bit drier than normal. So I always like to use a leave-in conditioner. Once I shampoo my hair, I always use a leave-in conditioner. It helps to add that moisture, that extra moisture that my hair needs. So the first leave-in conditioner that I want to talk about is by Mark Anthony and it is Strictly Curls. Let me see, Strictly Curls Curl Envy Leave-In Conditioner. It detangles and Defrizzes, hydrates dry and frizzy curls, adding softness and shine. Now, I did a video, a review on this, and I will link it up here somewhere so you can take a look at it. I love these products, especially when you do wash and goes. And I just like this leave in conditioner for any style, okay? I like it. I like that it's a spray leave in. And this also says that it has avocado oil and shea butter in it. So I really do like this con leave-in conditioner. Sometimes, you know, these little spray nozzles don't work as well. So I'll take it out and put some in my hand. I make it work, honey. <laughs> but yeah, I love this leave-in conditioner. I was really shocked by when I reviewed the products. And I was like, wow, this is one of my favorite products out of the line. And I have another product, too, that I like from this line. So, yeah. The next leave-in that I absolutely fell in love with, I love this product line I love these products is by Baregio and it's the Curl Charisma Rice Amino and Avocado Leave-In Defining Cream. So it's really detangle and define my curls as well a lot of times lately what I've been doing with my washing goes is just using a leave-in and a gel it makes my hair just really come out so much better and I like that so yeah this is one of my favorite favorite leave-ins by Baregio I love it now the next leave-in conditioner is by Miel's and it's the pomegranate and honey leave-in conditioner. I like this one a lot. It says moisturizing and curl primer for detangle for thick curly tight for hair. Okay, so my hair has gotten a little thicker. Now with low porosity hair, with any products, you have to really work the product through your hair. But I love this one. This leave-in is wonderful. Again, this is one of the leave-ins that I use. Just really make sure I saturate it in my hair and really work the product into my hair shaft. And then I just apply gel for my wash and go. I also have used this for this like this kind of style too. I blow my hair out and use a little bit on this to twist my hair and then I rod it. Like using this with this as well. Really like this a lot. So yeah, this is the pomegranate and honey leave-in conditioner. It's, and it also smells so good. I get a lot of compliments when I use this and do my wash and goes. And with just with this style, my husband's like, oh, your hair smells so good. Love this. This leave-in is by Curl Smith. It is the weightless air dry cream leave-in conditioner for all hair types, okay? So it's this one right here. I think I did a review on this as well, and I will leave it up here. But yeah, I love Curl Smith products. I 
didn't think I was gonna like them they are very pricey but they are worth it so I use this sporadically because <laughs> these products are not cheap but yeah anytime you find good hair products it's, my hair is, is really funny so every, a lot of products do not work in my hair but when I find a good one oh love this leave-in conditioner let me show you how this one looks cruelty free and it's also vegan love 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 this product i haven't used this particular product but i have used the brand and it is the african pride olive miracle leave-in conditioner and it's right here now this one surprised me because I, i've used the one before it's another one that i use and i think this is in here i'm gonna show that as well i think but i don't have the job but anyway yes i love love this olive oil um, anti-breakage formula leave-in conditioner it says daily treatment and hair strengthening love this love this conditioner by um, African Pride really like it a lot I didn't think I was because I was like hmm let's see but yeah I really do like this leave-in a lot and I use it quite often When I use this leave-in conditioner, I notice that my hair has an extra shine to it. You know, it just shines and I just like the way it leaves my hair detangled. It's very, very lightweight, so it doesn't weigh my hair down. And that's what I like about this the most. It's very lightweight and it absorbs into my hair strand immediately. It, it like melts into it. So yeah, I really like this leave-in a lot. I like African Pride products anyway. They are really great. So yeah. So the last leave-in that I have is by Curls. It smells really good. And now this one I have to work into my hair a little bit. At first I didn't like it. I didn't used to like this product, but I said let me try this again because I have it here. Let me try. And oh my goodness, I've been using it up. This is a great one as well when I do a wash and go. And I just use leave-in and a gel. This is really good. Now what I have to do with this one is really, really work this into my hair because it's not as it's not real real thick but it's not real lightweight either but it is once you use a little bit and you go through your strands and you really just manipulate your hair do the praying hands method just really kind of make sure you work it into the hair shaft so it won't just lay there on your on your hair like i say low porosity hair you really really have to work products into your hair and i find that when I warm these products up, like if I'm in the shower and I just let it sit in the shower under the hot water, the warm water as I'm washing, you know, as I'm washing my hand, doing things, when I use this product and it's really nice and warm, it seems to just melt into my hair a little bit better. So yeah, even if you have to warm these leave-in products up and just put it up there for a little bit, I've done that as well. Put it in a little container, warm it up, works wonderful. And I just think that works well with um, low porosity hair, warming the products up. But anyway, I like this. Like it, like it, like it. I like the way it smells and I like the way my hair performs when I use this. So yeah, the Blueberry Biss Curls. Let me show you how this looks. This is an oldie but goodie. Okay, so the last products that we want to talk about is like the hair milks and the moisturizing oil cream type products, okay? So, the first one I want to bring to you is by African Pride. It is the Shea Miracle Moisture Intense Curl Activating Moisturizing Hair Milk for Natural Hair. And I love this, love this, love this. This is the way it is right here. This is actually like my second bottle, okay? Because I tried it and I fell in love with it and I've been using it ever since. Now you can use this like like an everyday oil moisturizer, like a moisturizing cream for your hair. And I like to do that. I like to put it in, especially if I have a wash and go or a twist out and you're applying it, it helps your hair even a, a wash and go you know when you're refreshing your hair you add a little bit to your hair rub it in and kind of go through it you know kind of go through it like this love this this is the moisturizing milk it works very very well i love it helps to keep your hair hydrated and moisturized 
also good when you have them days when you just want to wear a rock a ponytail and you apply this on here to give your hair some moisture you know especially now in the cooler weather your hair can tend to get a little drier than normal this is a great way to give it a little extra hydration okay love this for natural hair so the next item that i have is the for african pride as well is the olive miracle anti-breakage daily hydration or moisturizing lotion okay so this is how this looks you can use this in addition also with your washing goes this helps seal in moisture i like this because it, it is it says daily hydration it has a little extra oil in it so you can seal your hair products in there even when i do my washing goes i don't want to use a lot of like oil i could put a little bit of this in my hand rub, really rub it together and kind of break that gel cast using this I love this love this product and it's olive oil olive oil tends to work really well with my hair and i really like this this is a great moisturizing or moisturizing hair lotion as well on those days you want you know you want to use a ponytail as well this is a great one if you don't like the moisturizing milk as well you can actually use the daily oil moisturizing hair lotion love this love this as well so this is the last product last but certainly not least and this is by cream of nature now you guys know i love cream of nature i could not leave this out of the bunch but this is a newer one for me and this is the cream coconut milk hydrating curling cream this is like the coconut milk one high um, curling cream it, it still tends to be like a a little thicker moisturizing cream and I love this I love it I love it I love it you can do twist outs with this you can use it for extra hydration if you want to use this as a leave-in conditioner you can use that as well I've, I've substituted just to see how my hair would turn out and I love this love it love it love it here it is see now this one is a little thicker you know, if you can tell, I've been using it, but I like this. Oh, and it smells so good. Cream of Nature products always smell good. But yeah, this one smells so super hydrating, super rich. I love this. Love it, love it, love it. So yeah, uh, hydrating curling cream. It has uh, rich moisture and shine for soft, defined curls, okay? So yeah, this is great for a twist out as well. If you really want to give your hair some nice shine to it, this is it right here hydrating it lasts for days love this love it all right that is all i have for you today i hope this video was interesting and helpful if it was please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel on the way out if you haven't done so already and thank you so very much for just taking time out to watch my videos peace and love until next time Mwah. bye